Hi, this is Kanaya, and, and today I will be showing you how to do a single right crochet. Now, Because now I can focus on what's important. You can use any size hook that you, that you want, and you can use what I really any need is medication for my mind type of yarn thing. that you want. We're just doing it as a practice. And now, so I'm going to show now, you how to, a way to start. So the first, so the first, so the first thing you have to, so the first thing you have to do is to make a slip knot. And to make a slip knot is you're gonna wrap it around. You're gonna, you're gonna wrap it around twice. You take the first loop and you pull it over your second loop. You take the second loop and you're gonna pull it over your first loop. So that's how you make how you will make a slip knot. And to make it, so now you want to take your crochet hook and you're gonna pull it in this inside the hook and make sure you pull this tight. But not too tight. But you make sure you pull it tightly so your yarn strings don't come loose. So the first thing you're gonna do. Is and you want to wrap it around? Really you saw it? Or anything that I need like it's okay. that. It's okay. Yeah. Yeah. And I know for sure I don't have cancer. Yeah. So that's good. Huh? You all... So I'm in a much better place now, and I'm ready like, to get out. Cause I can get so hopefully that happens soon, and Doc tells me I'm ready to go. We don't have to do it today. Uh, I was just trying to figure out. For the past month, we have been working to get on your to a better place. You can hear it in the hospital. And in that time, tutorial, we have been able to get the work done around 70 pounds. And as a result of that, the conditions have been improving. But we can go for a walk for another day if it's supposed to be nice out this weekend. Can we go to Adventureland? We wish, Nisha. We very much wish. I heard that Adventureland is going to be open. It's open. Pandemic, so we wish. We wish to be there. Not really. So we can figure out something else, like yeah, and this is fine. I'm figuring how to make my holes bigger for the um, single crochet. Right. Okay. 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 Okay.
and you're gonna wrap it around again, and you're gonna pull it through. Okay, you can wrap it around and pull it through. So once you figure out how to do a chain, it's not, it's not very easy to start off with a slip knot for many beginnings, or or a chain. Chain change just to show you guys this way. For you guys, you can chain as long and as short as you want. So, so to do a single crochet, you can so you do, to do a single crochet. You're gonna go into the next chain. And you're going to wrap it around, and you're going to pull up a loop, and you have two loops on your hook, and you're going to wrap it around, and you're going to pull through two loops together. You go into the next chain, you wrap it around, and you pull up a loop. You wrap it around, and you pull through two loops together. Then you're going to do this, the same thing for the next chain. You go into the loop, you go into the chain, you wrap it around, and you're going to pull up a loop. You wrap it around, and you're going to pull through two loops together. And you're going to keep going. So now all you're doing is you go into the chain, you wrap it around, and you pull up a loop. And you're going to wrap it around, and you're going to pull through two loops together. You're going to go into the next chain, and you wrap it around, and you pull up a loop. And you're going to wrap it around, and you pull through two loops together. But the single crochet is like the easiest stitch, because I know it's not always, it's always easier, because I know people can do it any easy. So to wrap it around, and you're going to wrap it around twice, one time. Single is one time. So when you do a single crochet, you, all you're doing is you wrap it around, you pull it through. And you can go into the chain, you wrap it around, and you pull up a loop. And you're going to wrap it around, and you're going to pull through two loops together. And you're going to single crochet into this last stitch. Want arm wrestle? Nah, you can't handle calcium buildup. I'm too So now, you have your first row. Now I did my first row, first row of single crochets. So now we have to row number row two. So this is the end of row one. You see how I did one row of single crochets, of six single crochets. So you're gonna. So to do the next row. You're gonna chain. You're gonna. So you wanna chain one, and you're gonna turn your work. So you're gonna. You're not gonna single crochet in the first stitch. You're gonna single crochet in the second stitch. So to do that, you're gonna single crochet into the next stitch. So you're gonna go into the next stitch. You wrap it around, and you pull up a loop. And you have two loops on your hook. You wrap it around, and you're gonna pull through two loops together. You go into the next chain. You wrap it around, and you pull up a loop. 
or get up to seventy percent SRP cash back on select twenty twenty one. And you're gonna go purchase. you pull the two loops together. And you're gonna do that all stitch across until you have the amount of stitches that that you have. So we're gonna keep on going until you have. So now we're gonna keep. So now. So now you're gonna keep going until you have to go each stitch across. So you're gonna go into that chain and you're gonna wrap it around. And you pull up a loop. You wrap it around and you pull through two loops together. I can smell it because she's making popcorn. And then you're gonna go into the last stitch. You're gonna single crochet in the last stitch as well. I have a month to lose 45 pounds, and he's gonna help to make sure that I eat healthy. So we already done with row two. So, so to get to row three, something I could never say you're gonna wrap it around. So I'm really glad you saw my and you're gonna chain one, you're gonna wrap it around and you're gonna pull it through. You're gonna chain one and that's what I plan to do so I'm only eating and you're gonna turn your work. Oh my God, I just have to focus and try to ignore yeah. the things that you And you see, you're doing it's a good, so you're doing a good job. Yeah. Keep going. But Dave is a much better communicator than Justin. And, and it looks like you did a chain. Like that. That's awesome. And that Thank you. Stuff. And you know, I just like to listen. So now, now we're up to row number three. I know I started it over. And we're going to go into the second stitch from the hook. So you're going to go into the next stitch. You wrap it around. And you pull up the loop. You wrap it around. And you're going to pull through two loops together. That's how you practice. Practice makes perfect. So you're fighting with me, not even knowing what's going on. So you're gonna go into the next stitch, and you're gonna pull up a, you know, go in. So you're gonna go into the next stitch. You wrap it around, and you're gonna pull up a loop. You wrap it around again, and you're gonna pull two two loops together. You go into the next stitch. You wrap it around, and you pull up a loop. You wrap it around. You're going to wrap it around and you're going to pull through Being two loops together. together. It's the and you're going to do all. this all, all the way, all stitch across, across until you have okay, now it's now it's stitches. Too, but he's not with me every day, so, you know, having days to do that with is important. Okay, so I'm thankful for that and all the support that I have. Anyway, that was first hole that you see, the one of the holes. Elks, and then you wrap it around and pull it through, just like the chain, but you have to go through it. Open that first side. Just pay attention, Amira, because she's showing you how to do it. Amira, you're not really paying attention. I have like three more of these things left. What are I doing? I know I have a lot of people. So you can do a single crochet with the rest of the um next week's chains. Yeah. Like, look at my leg. Oh, thanks, Mavi. She's known me my whole life. And she's one of the people who got me to do this. So I want to show Thank her that you. it wasn't a waste for her to do what she did for me. You take one yeah. at a time out of here. Put this somewhere where it won't the get knocked over. Um, I hate to say, hey, yeah. this is the project too. So I love okay. the beautiful, beautiful woman for this job. No, you left this for Dr. Young. So now, we're here right now. So pick it up and I'm going to show you guys how to finish the row so you're going to single crochet into the next I still have to find a place of my own next two stiff next three stitches I'm going to need help recovering so I want to try and get a surgery while Mandy's down here so she can help me with that
So I'm motivated and more focused than ever to do this. So now row three is done. So you're going to chain one. And you're going to turn your work. And this is the last row I'm going to show you guys. And I'm going to get off camera. Because I've worked hard. So you're going to go into the second chain from the hook. And you're going to wrap it around. And you're going to pull up a loop. And, and you're going to wrap it around, and you're going to pull through two because loops together. No to and you're going to go into the and next chain, heart, so next I'm stitch, and you're going to wrap it around, and you pull up a loop. And you're going to wrap it around, and you're going to pull through two loops Don't together. So, so you're going to chain one and you're going to turn your work. So you're going to make a chain, you're going to wrap it around, you're going to make a chain. No, you're going to make a chain. So... Okay, I'm going to make the chain the same length as the other one. And yeah, make a chain and you're going to do a single crochet into the second stitch really from the hook. Oh, I'm about to make the chain length. And it'll be enough to show that for now. So, I deserve to move ahead with surgery. So hopefully it goes like it should go. So now that, drama, that we, we have... Like the last time I was here. Yeah, so now that we can... So now we have four rows of single crochets. So I'm going to show you guys how to fasten off. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to cut the yarn. So you're going to wrap it around. So you're going to wrap it around. And you're going to pull it through like that. And this is how you fasten off. So, that hopefully, you like this tutorial. Bye.